Hi. I'm Alyssa. <laughs> I'm sick. And this is Stitching at the Cabin. Hi. How do you feel? Sick. Way better than yesterday, though. Way better than yesterday. I don't yesterday. know how you got a cold. <laughs> I haven't been sick in forever. <laughs> At least a week. I'm pretty sure it's well documented on the last video. I mm -hmm. said, I'm gonna get sick from mm -hmm. you. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Take and everybody it down. likes to point out, like, ooh, you have coronavirus. And I'm like, no, I don't. I haven't been to China. I haven't been anywhere with any of the sick people. I've been with this one. Nah. I'm sorry. No, you're not. But <laughs> she, sorry. she did bring me a medicine ball from Starbucks this morning. I didn't know that was a thing. It's probably delicious. I couldn't taste it. You know how it is when you have a cold and you can't taste anything? I could tell it was lemony. And it was hot and soothing and amazing, and I want like 12 more. I don't like tea, but one time when I had a cold, I got that because I was so miserable. And it, it kind of worked. You can't taste tea, it, so. so you cannot tell it's tea. Right. I can only tell it's something really lemony. Yeah. She, best she seemed to feel a lot better for the first like five or six hours of work, and then yeah. after that, like, <laughs> and I went, hmm. crashed hard. <laughs> And now we're here. <laughs> Hi. <laughs> mm. So I guess we'll try to do our best to keep this kind of quick and soothing. <laughs> it doesn't have to be quick, but I'm not going to be like, whoa, high energy. Stop breathing on me. <laughs> <laughs> I did apologize to her because when she was sick, she kept sneezing, and I was like, stop it, I'm not saying bless you. And then we'd be working along in the office, and I'm like, I can hear you breathing. I don't know what I was looking at, by the way. I wasn't looking at you, I wasn't looking at her. I'm just staring off in the space. Stop it! And then I laughed at her when she had the waterfall nostril faucet mm -hmm. explosion. And then she texts me all day yesterday. She's like, I am so, so, so sorry. I picked on you. This isn't fun. I can't control my nose. I keep sneezing. I feel so horrible. I have sneezed so many times that African Grey now sneezes like me. Which like, he's not sneezing, but he makes the sneezing noise. He did it last night and everybody started laughing. I was mid-sneeze and it's hard to sneeze and laugh. It's like a laugh. Snaff. I snaffed. I wish I was there. Yeah, I wish he would say bless you instead of just mocking me. <laughs> he has l yet to learn manners. <laughs> He's so funny. So what's first on the list? I have the, the 20 mistake? versus the 25 because yeah. we were bad and we should apologize. Well, I was sick so I wasn't really clearly thinking. And, um, I have it didn't, no excuse. It didn't really help that we were talking about how horrible the fabric was, how hard it was to count, and then didn't show you? I'm fairly tall bookshelf. I'm sorry he listened to like 15 minutes of ranting and had no idea. So we took pictures. You'll see the 25 count, which is very easily gridded. And you'll see the 20 count for the fairy tale, which is much more ambiguous. And I know, I just know you're gonna look at it and think, well, it's more faded than the other one, but it should still be pretty easy. No, just start counting, like pause the video and start counting. Even that, that is not that bad. Pretend you're gonna put a stitch in and you want the stitch to meet up 999 stitches later, but like It it's wasn't until I actually went to pull the needle through and to go back down. I was like, mm, maybe that's not it That's when I realized it's ambiguous. It's a problem. It's ambiguous. So there's your photo. I'm sorry I realized today that the main difference between the two fabrics is that the 20 count has the line down the center of two different squares so it's on one line of dots instead of being directly in between two dots that would be one stitch that's the main difference and that's what makes it complicated because if we want to start on the gray where does the gray start we also didn't really show you how big it was exactly there's a picture of it on my sofa but um i believe we will be inserting a picture of me laying next to it so you can better try. see the size 
of the fairy tale. We didn't get much stitching done on it last week, so. No, because somebody was sick, and then somebody's yeah. other half was didn't home work. all week. <laughs> I love and it. guess who else is, well, guess who is also not working enough this week? Again. Him. Again. Yeah. So maybe we can work on it. Tonight. Those tablets are odd. They make noise. I'm sure For there's no particular system. reason. Those Samsung I have think it's just all I of a sudden because there's a software do update do do available. Do do do. But you don't did get you notifications on here. Did you have keep it update? So. Yes, it did. And then did it tell you, like, you didn't buy it? No. Yeah, mine told me I didn't buy it. And then it was like, we still the purchase? And I was like, um, yeah, you don't get to kick me out. And then it was better? And then it was better. That's good. So is that what's going on here? Yeah, I just, no, this was just, it was, <laughs> no, I'm sure it was just like an update or something. They like to ding at you, but I just turned it off. Yeah, mine makes that noise and I'm just, I can turn this off later. <laughs> what is it? Why is it making that noise? Yeah. What did I do? Anyways. Uh, so we didn't get a lot done. Hopefully we can maybe work on it tonight. Yeah. You know, I said that I'd probably work on it more than you, and then I was like, eh, we should just work on it together, but now I'm kind of back to maybe we should work on it separately sometimes, because we're never going to get anywhere at this we rate. We are. We, this is just a bad, I always have the bad weeks to start. It's just, it just, we'll get our stuff together, yeah. and we'll get moving on that, because I think, I think some of you want to see it and see progress, and we'll try. Yeah. What else? Okay. Then I thought we'd do whips. Don't include your new start because I have a whole special section for okay. the new start. Okay. All right. So, and I don't want to do that because that's ours together unless you want to do it first. Um, I can do something first that way. Unless you no, want I mean, to go first. I mean, do you oh, want to do, do these oh, first? I left mine downstairs. Wow. This Please is hold. Bad. Entertain the people. No, I'm not doing that. <laughs> We're going to cut this out. <laughs> Okay, there Hi. definitely wasn't an awkward pause there, so, um... Well, I hope it was an awkward pause, because if you leave that in... <laughs> Let's show our temperature trees. Okay. Ready? Yeah, maybe. Yeah, maybe. Okay. Ready? Uh-huh. Put it up here. Ready? One, two, three! Woo! Woo! I don't know if I'm playing... You, you do have lots of green. You do, too. Yeah, I know. I told you. I started getting yeah. into lots of green here. The colors are pretty consistent. This looks a lot like Stitching Mommies. Really? Yeah. Hmm. Yeah. Which, I mean, we all live in Southern California, so that doesn't really surprise me. Kind of makes sense, I guess. We're all inland. Yeah. Kind of. Ish. Yep. Now I did do something exciting. I got, it rained twice, so I got to do the little thingies. I tried to show this earlier just to test, and I don't think you can really see the sparkles that much. But it looks good. In, um, in real human Yeah, I was going to try recording it with good. my phone real quick. Because I got to take pictures that. of them anyways. I'll Hang show on. you mine oh, in yeah. the meantime. Don't hang on. Well, I thought you were going to put it away. Don't hang me I on. I put it away. I got concerned. No, I'm not putting it away. I'm getting it closer. Still have my little clown section and then a lot of blue and green. I need to do more trunk. I finally finished that one strand that was attached, but... Oh, and I, I told you I changed my needle minder. I did. Yeah, you did. I Yay. All around after that day, I said it was, but good. I don't know if I pointed it out. Nah. So, cool. I, I'm very happy with our trees. Put it on Instagram on the, I saw. Um, well, my thing, and then hashtag the tree, temperature tree 2020. Oh, okay. Whatever. I didn't realize there was a hashtag. <laughs> yeah. And um, I realized when I put pictures like that, the trunk doesn't even look variegated, like, at mm. all. And I was like, huh, people are going to think I'm weird. Well, people already know I'm weird. But there's some dog here in there. That helps. That is that is partial variegation. Yeah. Think that counts. Yeah, I think so, too. I'm still really enjoying it. Like, I wake up in the morning, I'm like, ooh, I can't wait to check the weather. And then I check it, like, all day until it starts to go back down. And I'm like, ooh, I can do it now. See, the last two weeks I've done it the day we film, which is a good way to stay accountable with it. Like, because I have to do it then, but I kind of like doing like five days in a row. It's like, ooh, what was it? Wow, there's a big difference between those two days. And then I just do them real quick. Well, I don't take it on the weekends when I go to the cabin. Mm. So I just can't, I have a note 
thing. Everybody that has an iPhone has a note thing, but I have a note in my note thing. Uh -huh. And so I put Saturday and I put the day in Sunday and I put the thing. But this time I put it Monday too because I was sick. Then I was like, ah, oh, I should just do it. So I did three days. Two of the three were the same color. I mean, they were all easier. Like clean, but two with one clean. I'm sorry. So, yeah. Okay, go ahead. You can go next. I was working on my Shiley a little bit today. I didn't touch it yesterday. I didn't touch it over the weekend. But so now it has is, cuties. Yeah, I was doing this section, but on both. So that will underneath. Touch and me. the, <laughs> there may be some more done in the flowers. I can't really remember. I have cold brain. Not gonna lie, I don't see much of a difference, but I think it's what? just. No, I just don't. All of that! Oh, see, I had cold, and I don't think I fully remember what it looked like before. Okay, it's not my fault. I'm hiding behind it this time. I, I don't see that. Want it. Okay. My red, puffy, sad nose doesn't want to be in it. Um. Ooh, fun note Steve and Dad both think they're getting sick. Two man colds. Oh, no. About your thing, but also because I just lost a needle minder, and I'm not sure why. Well, while you try to figure that out. And it had all my... I'll oh, just show it is. <laughs> you know, you're so helpful. Look, I haven't been doing much black. It's actually been a lot of this that's weird. bluish okay. color. Bluish. And, like, that's the bottom and the end. Like, I'm so close. So oh, yeah. close. You are close. So you said you were close. close, but that's like actually really close. Oh, I'm, look at I'm, all the blue. Yeah, I've just been having trouble like getting up early enough to do it. I'm still having nightmares every night, and time change is messing with me. And then I took <laughs> Nyquil last ago. night. And that don't do that. That doesn't make sleep better. She that and just, Nyquil don't go. No. Well, Mary, who watches, she told me she gets sleep paralysis when she takes it. So mm. I was already a little nervous. I didn't get sleep paralysis, but. It dries out your nose so much that I felt like I couldn't breathe. I know that's weird and it doesn't make any sense, but I kept waking up thinking I was going to die from not breathing. It's a bad night quill trip. <laughs> I'm not taking night quill again. It used to be Gatorade that gave me nightmares. I don't know what's doing it now. It's been like a month oh, of nightmares. Oh, I do remember that. Every was night. it Powerade? I thought it was Powerade. It's the same thing. Oh, I thought you were Powerade, Gatorade. One. If I drink it at night, I would get nightmares. Now I don't know what it is. I had a nightmare that my husband had Alyssa killed. It was awful. Last night it was about birds dying. It, not mine, but it is yeah. awful. I don't know. Yeah, I'm a psycho chicken. Okay, can I show you mine now? Yes, I want to see Okay, it. I did. Well, I won't tell you that yet. 12 stitches. No. <laughs> I'm going to show them. Or show you. Who do you want to see first? Okay, show them. ready? Way, you know. This is Universe in a Jar. Wham bam. I can sort of see it. Yeah. I moved my head. <laughs> I can Thanks. see it from the back. Yeah. Looks Ready? nice from the back. You're almost done. Look at all Holy of that work. Holy moly, that's a Isn't lot. Isn't that so much? How many stitches did you do? I did more than 700 on this. Well, I knew that because you told me the other day I did 700 stitches. Right. But then today you said I added a I lot. I did 1,000, I think. Well, I added all of my stitching from one week. So this week, in total, between this temperature tree and a new start, I had 1,403 stitches. Holy cow, that's a lot of stitches. Who's doing better? I am. She is. Yeah. So actually, Universe was 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, about 1,200 stitches. Did you draw So I did 211 today. Did you draw those incredibly straight lines over there? Did it didn't come that way? <laughs> oh, I thought you... No. <laughs> you gotta show them because I said something. <laughs> it's, uh, there's these little lines on here. <laughs> The way those light was hitting it, they looked black, and I was like, did you draw that? Like, you could have gotten a little I got a little no. on a bottle. <laughs> that's how it was printed. So why did you do it? So you were like, dissing me, and I didn't even do it. It came that way. Uh, but since, look, I got to the bottom of the page of ooh. my journal, so that means I'm going to switch it, and then I'm going to start doing different colors for different ones. Uh, like, sick week. <laughs> yeah. Sick week. It was sick week. I didn't do anything that week. So, get out of the face. Get your face out of the picture. So, yes. <laughs> but isn't this so exciting? This is really exciting. There's so and much done. Yeah, so that makes it real quick. Really quick again. I might just go down to the bottom with the blue and then restart. And I don't think you noticed, but look, 
There is, I'll show them after, there's this blue line that, that comes is up Is that like here. a unicorn? Blue? I don't know. I don't want to look at the picture because I don't want to give it away, but something mm. is right here. Something. See right here? Look, there's like this archway. It's supposed to be all reds and stuff, but there's like this blue thing that's coming up there. I don't know what it is, and I like the surprise. So we're going to see what the blue thing is. I don't know if it's just light maybe coming from somewhere or... I'm so going to send you a picture. Of what? <laughs> oh, but it's supposed to Well, it's to on be. this. Like, it's on this thing that's, like, right here, and I just keep not looking at it because I don't want to know. I love my keto up there. Thank you again, Joanne Desert Stitcher. She looks at it all the time. I do because I sit <laughs> here and stitch, and it's just right there. So I'll look at it. Follow my eyes. It's up there. And, uh... Like, I'm like, what's with all these bluish colors? And I look up and I'm like, oh, yeah, look at that. It's bluish colors. <laughs> so it's, it's actually really nice having that up there. You okay? Oh, yawning. Sorry. Yeah. No, don't look at me. <laughs> Did you want to watch us yawn the rest of the video? We, we could, could take turns. We could just take a nap. Oh, Group nap. nap. Um, I showed both of those, right? Yeah. Okay. I, um, told you I was buying a lap stand, a case creations. I'm going to sneeze soon and I apologize. <gasps> bless you. I can feel the tingle. I said bless you though, so it's Thank not going to happen now. Anyway, I bought the case creation lap stand and I had to wait and it finally arrived and I put it together, which was not as smooth as I had hoped, but I, I got it together. Mm -hmm. And I've been using it on the sofa when I work on the Hyacinth, which hasn't been a lot. I think I've worked on it five days total, including the day I started it. So in like two weeks, that was five days. That's not a lot. I'm mumbling. I'm sorry. <laughs> Life's getting harder. It's going downhill again. <laughs> <laughs> I've kind of changed. I started poking and then I decided I didn't like having the needles threaded when I poked on this. But anyway, Look, look at the lap stand. That's pretty neat, huh? It's all tilty and you can change all sorts of things. And there's my hyacinth. Hyacinth. Mm. Hyacinth. I enjoy it. I do. I really like the stand. I'm shocked how, how well balanced it is to so sitting on the sofa. I was worried it was going to tip. <laughs> Excuse me. I need to make a folder for your hyacinth. But it did not tip. That's good. I think you need one for stitch nanigans. I know. So I keep thinking about that. In fact, uh, your dad walked in the other day and I had it out and he was like, oh, is that a new stand? And he starts like pushing on it. He's like, that's really well balanced. I was like, yeah, <laughs> it is. He's, so we went to the cabin and he's like, why don't you bring your lap stand here? And I said, because I have a lowry here and that's better for like sitting in a recliner chair. Like the lap stand's great, but it's for you know more so upright turn, and you have to like be able to put it away so like when company comes or if you just don't want to see it and, like, not me i don't ever not want to see it but you know like i don't think he wants to see it so i really like it and he's like you should buy a second one i was like why i mean i only have one lap and <laughs> he's like because you know how it is when you find something that you really like and then a few years later like something happens and then you can't get one so I didn't buy another one, but I was thinking about it. I was kind of thinking about getting the one with the scroll rods. You were contemplating getting that one yeah, originally. That would be nice for beading. But it's, yeah. I think it's 14 to 20 inches would fit on it. And I think my shadow lane's wider than 20. Pretty sure it is, because it's on a 17 by 17 end ends. So it might not be, it might just, I don't know. Possibility. I might just might. But and I might like, just get one too. If you know and you haven't seen the highest since, then you should go back and watch other videos. <laughs> <laughs> I'm kidding. There's the highest synth. Gecko Rouge. We have so, a highest synth. His name is Kevin. See video one if you would like to see. That's true. Kevmo. People saw Kevin. Yeah. The very end of video one, Kevmo makes an appearance. I don't. I, his name's Kevin. But then I started calling him Kevmo, like Bevmo, and now it's changed to like Momo. And so sometimes I just call him Momo, 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 Momo. He doesn't talk yet, but pretty sure when he does, he's gonna say Momo, 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 Hachu. That's how it's headed. <laughs> okay, we have this one. Well, I, I'm wondering, do we even need to show him Fairy Tale? Because we really didn't do much. Do you want to see it? Well, they want to see okay. it. <laughs> That's not nice. Well, fine. I just, I don't know that they'd be able to 
tell like yeah. if there's you anything different. Wow, Jesus, my voice. <laughs> I'm a teenage boy that just hit puberty. <laughs> oh, I did it again. <laughs> Oh, you have my side, and I have your yeah, side. Yeah, this is my side. Look how much I've <laughs> no, done. No, that's my side. I did so much no, work this over is here. This crappy side. Wow. That's my side. Oh, you have a long way I to know. go. <laughs> I keep telling you, it's so much confetti on my side. You cheated me. But I looked at Do you see this? It's like <laughs> blue, blue, darker blue, darker blue, tealy blue, purple, purple. <laughs> oh, some confetti. Pink, yellow, orange. Oh, look, blue. The same color blue for like 800 stitches. <laughs> You have blue hair. <laughs> yeah, that was the. That's when you said, "I think I'm getting tired. I want to stop." I'm like, "I have, I have one color. I stopped having confetti. That's why I got you sick." <laughs> wow. You have pretty good. This she admits it now. But I did look at the picture, and you can have a butt ton of blue at the end. <laughs> anyway, whatever. We're at least far enough apart from each other now. We can just glare at each other from distance so I can poke her with needles when she's not looking <laughs> helpful do you know what's painful <laughs> pine cones oh I know they but have pricklies in them not the full pine cone cuz like my vision's good enough I can not step on a pine cone but apparently a piece of one had broken off just what do you call it when it's just a piece of a pine cone a pine, pine cone leaf. A cone it's not a leaf it's, it's like a, a it's not a pine it's needle a prickle, but a, yeah a prickle a pine prickle <laughs> A cone prickle? I'd say a cone prickle. It's a cone prickle. One of them apparently had fallen cone off. Cone leaf. Cone leaf, maybe. <laughs> there were a lot of them outside, but this one I assume got stuck on someone's shoe and they walked in and went, what was that? And moved and it fell off. I mean, I don't know what else, how else it got in there. It didn't walk, walk. but somehow it, it got in the kitchen. And I don't wear shoes in any house. <laughs> Unless you have a very unclean house and then I, I wear shoes. But, um... <laughs> In, in my houses, your house, I don't wear shoes. Mm -hmm. And um, I walked into the kitchen, I think I was going to make tea because I wasn't feeling real great, and I stepped right on the pine cone prickle and I shrieked. And I was like, what is that? I swear you, I thought I stepped on a needle. Like, it felt like a needle dug into my foot. What part of your foot? I don't really want to know, but what part? The well, archway, the toe the, part, the, the or the heel part, part? The bumpy toe part, the okay. part that sticks out down there. Ah! Yeah, that's painful. I put it back outside where it belonged. That was nice of you. Yeah. You could have burned it, so I'm proud. We, we didn't have a fire. Oh, would you have we, burned it? Mm -hmm, I would have felt bad. <laughs> <laughs> we had a fire Friday night, and we were supposed to have a fire Friday Saturday night. That's the day after Friday, right? Yep. Mm -hmm. But we had company. Hey, today is January 28th. Yep. 2020. Tuesday. Ish. Probably. Sounds right. I took the trash out, so hopefully. My trash is until Thursday. But they just paved a street and now they have to do a slurry seal. I can't say that, but they're going to do that. And they put signs up today. We watched them because we could see from the office putting up signs and they put notes on all the doors. So this Thursday, we can't park on the street or drive on it or walk on it or lick it or anything. And now everyone knows where you live. They can narrow you down. Trash on Thursday, roads being repaved. You live on a street that's repaved on Thursday. Southern California, not in the Cabin Mountains. Seriously, I mean, if you go through just all saying. that effort, like you, you should have just, spy. you should have just texted me or emailed me or something and asked me what my address was. It would have been a lot easier. <laughs> I probably would have given it to you. Yeah. It's easy. Okay. I have anyway. plenty of security, so even if you find me, I'm a, I'm a know you're here before you know you're here. <laughs> okay, that's not <a> scary. <laughs> what? You know, like, have you ever tried watching TV at night when someone makes a delivery outside? The TV tells you, your watch tells you, the phones tell you, all the dinosaur pet pets in the house tell you. you. Like, you get emails and text alerts, like, we know if you're within five feet of the, what's more than five feet, if you're within 20 feet of the house Just or the cabin, we know. <laughs> we know. Can you start time? No. Uh, I'm not done yet. I have to find it. Oh. You forgot it, didn't no. you? No. You lost I it. I suspect it's on the other side. Oh, no, it's down here. It's down here. That's what I worked oh. on this weekend. And I, I was 
kind of sad when I was at the cabin because I realized I'm probably not going to finish it this year. I said I thought I would, but I underestimated exactly how much confetti was in it. Looks like you so, did a pretty good amount. I tried. I tried. Yeah, it looks really pretty. Again, we got company, so. Yeah. Yeah, but I got to find which way is up. This way is up. There we go. Hopefully with the before and after you see lots of good stuff. Yeah. I did put a picture on Instagram, but I tried to filter to try to make it look more like the natural color, but yeah. I think it just made it like bright, <laughs> bright sunshiny thing. You take picture, then I'll tell you what I did. I'll tell you what I did, what I really, really did. I'll tell you what I did. What I really, really did. Would you? Would you? Would you? Would you? Would you really, 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 <laughs> really, really did? Wow. <laughs> Bye. <laughs> Fifty of you just clicked off. Is it even fifty? <laughs> no. Okay. Hold one side. Oh, it's such a point. With you can keep looking at me. I'm like, oh, what's I on? did all that over there. I finished most of the birdie. I did this part up there. I did the flower and the other flower. Mm, finished the pineapple. I feel like the problem is that you have Except a lot of colors. Top. It's not that there's a lot of colors, it's that they're very scattered. Like they don't like to stay in one spot. There's yellow, and then there's yellow, and there's yellow. Which isn't so much of a problem in this section, because you just sort of jump around and I have a lot done. It's over here in the border, because there's fruit over here, and so it's, you know, three stitches of that, four stitches of that, and you can't run it under the super pale, pale, pale half stitches. So you have to disconnect it and start over. And it jumps around, so it's not like I can just count over three and be good. And, you know, we've we've established I can't count. <laughs> so I can count to one, two. And that's, that's it. That's about and sometimes two is too much. <laughs> well it looks good things. so far. Thank you. It looks I, like an object. I really, really enjoy it a lot. So, um, Stitch and Mommy, you should start on yours. I know that wasn't in your plans, but... So, are we going to spin the wheel just in case we go to the cabin this weekend? Yes. I may work on the closet this weekend. I bought the paint. Did you know they have a new, like, spackle-y thing? You know, to, to fill the holes putty? Mm -hmm. Putty, not putty, not spackle. Yeah. Putty? Mm -hmm. Spackle. I think it's putty. Spuddy. Okay. Sp I don't know. They have one that's pink. It goes on pink, and then it dries white. I did. I did know that. He was like gonna pick a different one. I was like, but that one's pink. <laughs> He's like, do you want that one? I said, I want that one. Since I have to do the work, I should get to pick the color. And if you have more fun doing it. <laughs> I don't think it's fun. So I don't think it's more fun. I, well, it will be more fun than just white. It'd be less awful. Yes. <laughs> Slightly less awful. So anyways, we don't know if we're going to the, because I will go to the cabin if they're going to the. Tay Tay. <laughs> Taylor Swift is releasing a documentary thing on the 31st. And that's kind of my dad's thing with me. Like, we do <laughs> so not him alone. No, like, that's our thing. This is what we do. We do Taylor Swift concerts and we watch, like, stuff. So we're thinking on the 31st we're going to watch her concert and then we're going to watch her her movie thing. It's going to be awesome. I'm going to get some snack food. But we don't know if we're going to be here or at the cabin. So if they go to the cabin, I have to go with them. I've been kind of nagging that we shouldn't go to the cabin this weekend. I love the cabin, but I really want to start in the closet. It won't take me long to take stuff out, but I'm not good at the demo. So he has to demo what's in there, and then I can spackle. And I just generally Spuddy. like here because it's closer. So. I think the paint color is going to be kind of dark, but I really like it. I didn't show it okay, to no, the I camp because it. it's still in the trunk of the car. Okay. Pull out your phone. But look, I have slippers on. <laughs> it's a bunny. Sorry. Oh yeah, that's why you needed my phone. Uh-huh. If we don't go to the cabin, I'll save whatever this spins for the next week and I'll work on the trunk of the temperature tree. This weekend? This weekend. Yeah. Because I don't want something to not get time if it was... Spun. Spun. Oh boy, I should have planned for this. Post to Instagram. <laughs> you hit it this time. I don't want to touch your cooties. I don't want to touch your cooties. I don't want to touch your cooties. Are you recording? I am. Okay. He didn't verify. Yes! Yay! <laughs>
kind of changed for a second. That. I thought it was castle when I first looked at it. I know that's a big word for castle, but like <laughs> I saw a castle and I was like, ugh. But no, he, no offense, Leah, Virenga, and and it's just, you guys are both talking about that, but it's just not my favorite thing to work on. I want to finish Christmas sentiments. I have a problem right now. I want to start everything, and it's the fault of this thing that I'm going to show you. But, but. I am in a thing where it's like, I don't like to start stuff. I hate the, the starting because it's scary. You have to measure and put it in. and Make sure you start in the right spot. And the fabric's the right size and going the right direction. And All very complicated. But man, I want to start. I'm, I feel like I'm not going to live long enough to see everything finished, but I want to live long enough to at least start stuff and get a good start so I can see what it's going to look like. I'm having this like midlife stitching crisis. I say just start things, but... And I'm gaining weight. But if I start things, because I'm not exercising. Christine was supposed to fix me with her Wellness Wednesdays, but she's amazing, but so far I'm not fixed. <laughs> um, User error. What was I saying before I said I was gaining weight? Oh, you said start all the things. The problem with starting all the things is then I won't finish things because then when I do the spinny wheel for the rotating, I don't smirk at me. <laughs> Bless it. I'm, you know, like, I figured Villa Mirabilia is going to take, like, six more weekends at least to finish. Like, it could be more than that. But just looking at it, if I got solid stitching weekends, I think I could do it in six. So, what are you doing? Nothing! I'm just <laughs> looking! I'm just... Do I'm sorry. <laughs> Thank you. This is, this is, this is much better. This I'm going to lick you and you're going to get sick again. I don't want to lick you. Um, <laughs> this is what you wanted. I don't know what I was saying. She regrets her decisions. Mm, so, like, the Villa Mirabilia, if it was six weekends, let's just pretend it was. If it was six, I could probably finish it this year because without chance and randomness and all that, I figured, you know, there's 52 weeks in a year, right? And I probably don't get to stitch all 52, but but let's say I stitch a lot of them. A lot. <laughs> a Scientific lot. turn. A term. lot. I didn't say wad, I said lot. Are you sure it really sounds like wad? <laughs> gonna stitch a lot of them. Just got like the image of wet toilet paper. Like I'm gonna stitch a lot of it. Wow. Okay. <laughs> Just saying, they want how to pronunciate. <laughs> I can't remember how many whips I had, but when I did the math, it worked out to like eight. I must have six, because I figured that was eight each, and I think that made it like 48. Sure. Six times eight. So if each were called an equal amount of times, and say I stitched most weekends. Mm -hmm. <laughs> what? <laughs> They would all get eight. So, Mirabilia is possible with six. Yes, that would make sense. Christmas sentiments, I think, is two or three. Probably three. I could potentially finish it, so I need it to come up. But if I start new things, then that takes it from, you know, if I don't have six, if I have more than six, the six that I rotate, I have more than six, but the six that I rotate, then, you know, when you start throwing other stuff in, then it slows down the other stuff, and I don't know if I'll finish things then. I think you should start a category called Passion Project. And it's just when you feel like you really want to do something, you do it. And you don't put it, like, you can start other little things, but you don't put it on a wheel or anything. It's just if you feel really, really like you want to do it, you do it. Until you don't feel that way anymore. And then it's not forgotten, but it's like pushed aside until it is time for it to join the wheel. But when does it join the wheel? Because then I'm like, well, I already started it, so now the thrill is gone. Well, then I'm like, well, I already started it, so now when I finish something, I don't spin for a new start, I put that other thing. See, I have a very complicated brain. I think you don't know what you want. I don't know what I want. That's why I have a wheel. The wheel tells me what I want. The wheel was right. Remember when the wheel did Ugly Birds twice because I, we messed up the first time? The wheel knows. <laughs> You could add new start to your wheel. I thought about that, but that's just adding more projects again. Which I want to do, but I don't want to do that. You could even do it so it's like new start if if spun on the second week of the month. 
So like you only start a new one if it lands on the second week. Then it's the world telling you for sure, yes, you should start something new. It's the second week of the month. It's a new full moon. Wait, a new moon's not full. A full moon. And it's Jupiter that, is in alignment. It's that time of the month. Right, exactly. <laughs> and then you can start something new. See? Okay. It's a possibility. She has a new start. I do. She needs more new start. She's still not rotating. Although she told me with this thing that she, if she was the one doing it, she'd be really tempted to rotate. I almost gave it to her, just like I'll do a different one, but I really like it too. You'll see it in a minute. I really want it. But I really wanted this thing too. So as you may or may not know, I have a bunch of mill hills that are animal themed because I love the little mill hill animals. Uh, I got a bunch of them because I ordered them for myself once, but I couldn't order just one, so I ordered three or four for myself. And then for Christmas, I got a bunch of them too. So I combined them all into a little bag at home and I really wanted to start one because of my llama bobbins, which I get to show you <laughs> now, bobbins. finally in person, and because of the tacky bob. So I really wanted to start a new one. I'm excited to get to see the llama bobbins in person because I knew you showed them to me the other day, but it was at an angle I couldn't see that well. I saw the bottom of the little feetsies. Yes, so you'll get to see them. Um, but So I wanted to start one, but I didn't know which one to start because I had so many of them. And Jacob was home. So I told him, okay. Jacob's always home. That's why we can't do the bookshelf. <laughs> I said, okay, pick one. And originally I just had the ones out that I got for Christmas because at this point in time they were in two different places in the house. And he looked at them and he picked a penguin. And then I was like, wait, I forgot. I have the ones that I bought earlier. Let me go grab those too. So that way they could all be in the same spot. And I said, do you want to switch out penguin for any of these? Or are you good with penguin? And he immediately saw this one and said, you have a hedgehog? <laughs> so I, I started this, pose. this week, <laughs> this week I started little Mr. Hedgehog. This is my progress on little Mr. Hedgehog. Yeah, a long time ago. <laughs> I just noticed. There you go, there's I little Mr. Hedgehog. This one has... Oh, I was hiding behind you fixing my nose. <laughs> this one has a lot of um, stuff that the other ones haven't had. For instance, it not only has back stitching, but it has single strand, single straight line straight, straight, <laughs> straight stitch. Yeah, you're right. <laughs> I didn't want you to be I'm right, but you're right. right. Yeah, it has straight stitches, and then there is one French knot that I now have to learn how to do. You want to use a different needle for the French knot. Why? Because if you use a tapestry needle, the eye is better than the oh. um, shank. <laughs> I don't know what you call it. Some ears. <laughs> my ears just started ringing. That's fun. Here's you my mama's. At them. You know when you go. Oh. No. Now, so cute. I was a little concerned about not being able to label them because they're llamas and I could use sticky notes or something, but you know, you don't want to write on them. But I realized it's all okay as long as you um, line them up before you start working. I have an idea for the next time you need to use them and you don't want to write on them. What's that? You should get a piece of paper and put it on, like write the number or the color or whatever, um, kind of a mm -hmm. long one, and put it on there and then wrap the thread so that the number is sticking out its butt. That is smart, except for the ones that only have one. And then I have to undo it all the way, and then I'd have to pull the paper back and then do it again. Like it would be fine, but also like kind of not fine. You feel? No, I don't feel. Okay. Let me, hang on, sorry. I'm organizing my llama colors so that way you can see. Do, do, do. Oh wait, that's probably copyright. I don't want probably. to get this kicked off. Okay, I'm gonna take a picture for ya. Cause you can't really see on the bear situation. I'm gonna touch my nose again, just cause it's itchy, not cause it's leaking. It's itchy, it's tingly. Yeah, I understand it's that. It's that sneeze tingle. Don't you wish you could just sneeze? Like, just sneeze. Mm -hmm. Okay, so there's all these browns over here and a cream. And so the pattern calls for, let me just do a video here. The pattern calls for very light brown, light brown, medium, or... It's yeah, it's a silence. <laughs> Don't worry, it was Michelle alive. I was trying to think, yeah, it is medium brown, 
dark brown, very dark brown. So if you don't have them all lined up, it's hard to tell. But when they're lined up, it's very easy. And this is like cream. And these are my greens and my pinks. And my kind of grays. There's actually 12 colors in this kit, which I was kind of surprised by. I like how they have a little slit right there. Yeah, so I Not learned... in a creepy way. <laughs> I learned it doesn't hold the full six strand, but as soon as you take... Like this is... Um, for this, you do uh, three over, three strands. Mm. So once you take your three strands, it's like very easy to put it in there. I'm always worried I wasn't recording that whole time. I got it though. We're good. I so that's my new start. The tissue again. It's not leaking. It just it was actually it came really not to ignore you, but um, it, <laughs> okay. Nobody wants to talk about my nose. <laughs> it came in handy because um, it wasn't really last weekend because we posted it, but like on Friday or Saturday maybe we Friday on Friday we. Um, you okay? No. You keep no, 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 I'm wondering. It probably <laughs> doesn't really matter. Oh, because we post it on Thursday, but we film it on Tuesday. So, like, end of last week, Jacob was home. Because he's always home. <laughs> and um, we were doing projects, so we, like, washed all the cars and waxed them. And um, then Jacob decided he wanted to clean out the inside of his car. I was done. I, we had been working all day, and I said, I'm going to sew. And so I actually brought out a lawn Stitch. chair. Don't Stitch. get us yes, in trouble. Yes. Sorry. So I brought out a lawn chair, and I started. that's when I started this project. So it's a good outdoor garage project for when he needs company. I really like it. I like it, too. Mill homes make me happy. The first stitch isn't satisfying, like, with um, pretty much anything else with fabric is. But, like, the eighth stitch Nice. The eighth one. Eighth, eighth one. <laughs> Just the eighth one. Eighth one's good. All right, we spun the wheel. Wheel. So haul. I got some haul. And I found out today that Stitchy Witch Forty Two Audrey does watch us. Yeah. I was really shocked. I. We were listening to the beginning actually of an audio book that she had just finished, and she went back to the beginning so I could hear it, and I shrieked and she had to pause it like what because like, this book was not shocking yeah it's like she does watch you know like santa is real the m ms they are real she does watch i was pretty excited you think m ms weren't real no but you haven't you seen that commercial where they see santa and santa sees them and they're like oh and they're like he, and santa's they like they are, are real them. okay okay i'm sorry i guess i should have explained that for people that don't don't oh, know. Confused. It's fine. This came yesterday. Whoa! Made me feel much better. I love that it's a book. This is the Christmas Village from Stony Creek by Afghan. This is Stitchy Witch's fault <laughs> because she's doing the Halloween one that she's going to. But if she had never showed that, especially if she hadn't showed me, because she only showed me. Yes. That video was strictly Personal. for me. <laughs> if she hadn't shown. On her video, the woman that did the Halloween one and how beautiful it was, I wouldn't have gone looking to see the Halloween one, and then I wouldn't have seen the Christmas one, and then put it in my coat and taken it out and put it in and taken it out and put it in and taken it out. And I gotta tell you, you can't see the chart because I can't show it to you, but it's we so both pretty. have like the same response when you look in it. It's like, it makes you very I happy, start this. like you wanna do it, yeah. It's 30 squares. Now, I'm going to assume that you're keeping the fabric white, right? Yeah. This one would be kind of odd to... Yeah, I thought about tying I it, know. but I was like, this going to be a problem with the trees, because I don't know that you stitch. Oh, well, maybe it's you do, do stitch that. I can tell. But, like, all this back here, it would just look weird. It would look weird, because it just looks all snowy, and if it wasn't white, I don't think it would look all snowy. Um, I was surprised that it is... It's it's 20 count Lugana, but it's 4 over 2 pretty sure. I will look again, yes. 20 count white Lugana worked over two threads using four strands of floss for cross stitch and two for back stitch. That's a lot of floss. Yeah, it is. But I want to do it. Like, I'm that's, considering. That's all the floss. Like, actually considering. But I don't want to do the same thing as you because then I feel bad. Because, like, what if I do it before you do it? Then you'd be like, <laughs> it's 
possible, then you'd be like, oh, it's already done. I told her to do the Halloween one, but she said she wanted to do the Christmas one. Yeah. So at the same time, I bought um, the Tropical Waters floss, but it's not here. I got a notice from 123 that it was back ordered when I bought the rest of this, and then I got the notice today that it shipped, but I don't know when it's going to be here. Um, but I also bought the Krynik for it at the same time. Pretty. I can't turn it without spilling it. Pretty. Oh now my God. hand's in the way. Oh my goodness. Help. Oh, I know. Look, it, you the can stand them up on my hand. hand. They're, you know oh. what? They're pretty. <laughs> they're pretty. They're very sparkly and they're pretty. And I think the purple was my favorite one. Not you my think. face. <laughs> Not her face. There we go. Very pretty. Blue, green, red. If this isn't focusing, you'll all get nauseous. <laughs> and gold. So that's exciting. Oh, just threw them. <laughs> just the one went for the walk. And then I got the stuff for Checkerbird. So I have fabric. That is 28 count lamb's wool linen. Not very exciting, but there you go. And then the Flossies. This is that infamous weeping willow that was missing. <laughs> it's amazing just putting your hand over the face fools it. I think that's lunar eclipse. We think. <laughs> yeah, that's lunar eclipse. Sticks and twigs. And blue corn. That blue one, corn? I love that. Yeah, I love how vivid that corn? is. I have no idea. Okay. And blue heron. So, I could start checking blood anytime I wanted to now. That's for the blue one, but there's enough fabric I think I could do the blue and the orange. <laughs> I want to do it a lot. Yeah, she wants to do the afghan, but I got the afghan fabric as well. Yeah, it's awesome feeling. It's the 20 count white afghan cut, 1.75 yards. That means nothing to me. I'm guessing it's the size of a football field. Does that <laughs> sound right? <laughs> But I don't know because I don't sew. I only stitch. So if I sewed, I'd get my hand caught in the sewing machine. And I assume that fabric is a yard wide, right? Mm -hmm. And then they measure it in how many yards long? Somebody is going, ah! Oh, probably that's my, Christine. That would if be Christine's my Christine's watching, she's going, ah! Oh. That's just my guess. I don't sew. I don't know. I don't plan on doing it, so I'm not just going to like, go out there. But. Audrey, she sews. I think Kim sews. Someone could tell us. A lot of women are capable and helpful. And We're not capable. Productive. We're helpful. I have not taken this. I mean, I've taken it. No, I haven't taken it out. I just touched it. And I said we were going to have to spread it out to see how big it is because oh, I just love sure the way massive. it feels. And they say not to serge the edges. This pattern says you have to be super careful to get it centered because there's only five inches on the edges and you need to make fringe out of it. So you have to do it right. And don't serge it because you need... It's hard to get the surging out, and you need the, the ends for the... Like. Over two would look so big. I'm doing over two. I know. I'm saying, look how big but it's going to be. if I did over one, it wouldn't be an afghan. No, 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 no I know. <laughs> I'm not a, complaining. I'm saying how awesome. Because it's going to feel so productive. I might do this. <laughs> I showed it to my husband yesterday because he worked from home, and... um. I was like, look, you know, I'm snoddling all over. I'm like, look, I got a package. Let me show you. And he was like, okay. And so I show him the, the thing. And he's like, oh, that's a blanket. He's like, are you making me a blanket? And I was like, well, I mean, I guess if you want it. And he's like, oh, good. I'm going to use it, like, in the living room or whatever. And I was like, oh, it's not that soft. Like, it's not. And, and so I made him feel. He's like, my hands are dirty. I'm like, well, just feel that edge and he felt the selvage edge and, it, and I said well you can go in a little bit like it, it's okay so he touched it and he was like oh oh that's not soft he's like why would you do that why would you make a blanket that's not soft I was like well it's not a blanket it's an afghan he's like what are you talking about it's like a blanket I was like no he's like well then what's an afghan so an afghan's a thing you put on the top of a bed that's decorative Just and he's like oh yeah. and he like walked away so I guess it's mine now <laughs> so my question is what do you do with the back do you do anything with the back or you just he leave? He said that too. He's like, well, you're going to put like 
a back on it and stuff stuff in it, right? And I said, it's not well, a little quilt, <laughs> it's an afghan. <laughs> yeah, but, that, but so do you have to just make sure your back's really neat and not free just so... If somebody well, flips it over, for it's not. The stress. I'm not trying to. I was just, just gonna lay it on the bed and assume nobody was ever gonna touch it because they know better. I would smack the poop out of them. Kind of feel like you should get another one of these, or like a cheaper, like maybe like a felt or something, and then have someone sew it. I just saw your finger, and I am not okay. <laughs> Just don't look at we were in the office today and she made this horrible noise and she's like I'm not gonna tell you but I just saw something on my finger and she just pointed and I saw her finger and I am not okay. Which finger, huh? The, the pointy finger. No, that one's okay. Oh no, it's not. Look, it's just it's white. It's just white. It's fine. Mm. It's not my nail is white. That's the fake nail. Look, see how my no, pinky has white nail look. still on it? That's not the problem. The problem is the middle one because it's cracked all the way back oh, here. Oh, that. That looks awful. It's just my nail. It's just the remainder of my Get big close nail. Sure. Let them decide Look. if that looks awful or it's not. It's just the remainder. Yeah. Cover your face. Yeah. It still doesn't see I'm it. Oh, I was going to lick you. Great. It's just the remainder of my fake nail. You almost elbowed me away. Well, you should face. stay over there. I want it. Would you be upset if I did the same thing as you? Not like, at all. Like, you sure? She, like, you went. So cute. <laughs> what if I finish it first? No. Yeah, I didn't say okay. finish it first. I said, like, do more than you. No, I absolutely don't have a problem with you. I would love if you did the same project. Just be aware this is not cheap. My birthday is soon. I'm not buying you this. I'll rotate. No. <laughs> I'll do it as a wheel. I love you. I'm not spending that much on fabric for you. You can buy your own fabric. Will you buy me everything else? No. Mm -hmm. You are a working adult. <laughs> I'm just trying to help you for my birthday. It's hard to shop for me. No, it's not. <laughs> Besides, I'm not giving you anything for your birthday. <laughs> I know, she beats me. <sighs> just joking, she doesn't. She's very <laughs> kind. <laughs> I wouldn't even burn the pine prickle. Like, I'm not gonna beat you. No, but you don't, you don't give me the goodies that came in the mail. Okay. I want. I bought you everything for the universe. I bought everything just about for the Okay, bookshop. will you send Except me the, the links to everything? Yes. Stony Creek and 123 Stitch. Okay, you easy, might, easy. you might want Chicken to. Chicken squeezy. You might want to send me information. Interesting tidbit. I wish I'd realized before I made the purchase. Stony Creek. If you're gonna buy the fabric, I got it at Stony Creek. They don't charge tax. Hmm. But one, two, three stitch does. So hmm. I should have bought those extra flosses that yeah. I needed from Stony Creek because I was already paying for shipping. Yeah. Oh well. Oh well. I hope I just didn't get them in trouble. They don't have a deal right now, right? Still. I don't know. I haven't looked because I bought it, so I took it out of the cart. If you want to entertain the people, I'll look. <laughs> I'll look. You keep entertaining the people. Whatever's next. Christmas Village, Afghan. I think this is it, so. I don't know what else we're going to talk about. You don't have anything else on your list? I don't think so. Um, I lost my list. No, that was it. I'm done. Wow, that was it. No, please don't. You're going to hit me. You're not coordinated enough for this. Besides, I've discovered it when I put my head down, stuff leaks out. You're welcome. You're welcome, people. We gotta go work on our fairy tale now so oh, she yeah. can snoodle all over it. I'm just gonna use this as a tissue. <laughs> just keep going. And we have to take pictures of you laying on the floor someplace. Yeah. So to find someplace big enough. Yeah, you could lay on the bed in the bedroom. Yeah, we could. That might be the only place that's big enough. Might be. Cool. We'll show you what both fabrics look like with me laying next to them. So, fairy tale and the afghan. why not? And maybe the next time you'll see me, I'll have an afghan. I started to shout out somebody oh. and then I forgot to finish. In her stitcher, she mentioned, I can't say it, Aaron. Aaron. The blind stitcher. The blind stitcher. He, I did not watch him before, but apparently like everybody did. And he um, is blind in one eye and then he has tunnel vision in the other and a blind spot in the middle of the tunnel. Oh. And he had a stroke and he has Parkinson's. That's a lot going That's against you. That's a lot you. going on. And yet he is so upbeat, so funny, and like, 
I really, I've only seen the first one so far, but I've put the others in my queue to watch. Mm -hmm. I really like it. He stitches better than people with fully fully functioning, functioning everything. <laughs> but I was really impressed. Like, wow. how the heck do you do that? And have a sense of humor about it. I, I did pause when he said, uh, he said the word game instead of something else. And he was like, I, I, I didn't mean that because he has problems, like, saying the word that he's thinking sometimes, or getting that word in his brain. I don't know what the problem, I think something happens. And he he was like, you know what, I don't need you to correct me. <laughs> I thought that was so funny. <laughs> you know those people that are gonna comment. He said before the reason he's, part of the reason he stopped was because he had so many trolls like came out of the woodworks, and I felt so bad. Like he's so Why are people funny so horrible? And, so, I'm definitely gonna be adding him to the list of people that I watch and Cool. So I don't know actually know what he's working on because I only watched the first one and now I gotta right. get all caught up. I only found him yesterday. and So thank you, Inner Stitcher, for introducing me. I guess Stitcherista pointed him out too, but I haven't seen hers. I saw Inner Stitchers, so. Hi. Hi, everybody. Okay, now we should go stitch on things. We'll have to clean this up first. Yeah. The ordeal. All right, goodbye, guys. See you next week. I'll be less snoodly next week. Maybe. I will be no less snoodly. I am so much less snoodly today from yesterday. Yesterday was miserable. Yeah. Sorry. Goodbye. Bye. Thanks for watching. This is a channel about craft stitch. Mm. Little late. Little late. <laughs> <laughs>